Yo, what is up everyone? I'm back with another video. This is going to be the sixth update of SFO International Airport. And for this update, I kind of have like a different idea. I kind of want to like film the whole thing from here. Um, I'll go over to the cargo stand and the runways when I, we get to those airplanes, but I'm just gonna start from over here. Sorry, I'm gonna attempt for my shadow not to get in the way. Anyway, starting at International Terminal G, we have a uh, United Airlines Boeing 747, and this one will be backing up for Beijing shortly, and this is in the old livery. Over here, we have a Hawaiian Airlines A330 in the new livery, and this one is on service to Honolulu. And then right over here, this is a special airplane. This is a very Boeing 777. And, uh, yeah, that's a really rare Darren airplane. Also, I don't think it flies to the airport, and I don't even know if it's still an airline, but I just decided to throw it in, and this one will be heading out to Brazil soon. And then we have two A380s today. Um, and the first one is just in the house colors, but it is operating for Philippine Airlines, and it'll be heading out to Manila. And then the second one is a Singapore Airlines A380, which will be heading out to Singapore. And then over here, we have an Aeromexico 787. This one just came in from Cancun. We have an empty gate. And then an Aer Lingus A320, but it should be an A330. And it'll be going to Dublin. And then way over there, uh, you probably can't tell because of the angle, but this is a Lufthansa A350-900, and it just backed out of this gate and is heading off to Frankfurt. Okay, I would say I was successful. So uh, now we'll head on to uh, International Terminal A. This isn't how I usually do the order, but yeah. So starting off over here, we have two WestJet Boeing 737s parked here today. And one will be heading out to Calgary. One will be heading out to Vancouver. And then a little further down, we have an AM International Boeing 777. I really don't know anything about this airline and I'm pretty sure it doesn't fly here, but we'll just say this one is heading out to Honolulu. And then even further down, we have an Emirates A380, just chilling at the gates and it's on nonstop service to Dubai. And then um, over there is an Air France A380. Um, and this one will be heading out to Paris Charles de Gaulle soon. And then over here we have a Qantas Boeing 787, and this one came in from Brisbane not too long ago. <laughs> oh, and don't mind my voice, it's kind of it's kind of cracking a bit, but yeah. Anyway, uh, we have a KLM Boeing 787 over here, it just veered off the runway. Here, I'm, I'm going to get a little closer, give you guys a better look. Here's the Emirates Qantas in Air France, and then... Here's the KLM. But yeah, anyways, it just came off the runway from Amsterdam. And then further down over here, over there, we have a UPS Boeing 747. And it is taking off for, uh, we'll say, Orlando. Uh, I, don't, I don't really know about those cargo routes, but whatever. Um, so yeah. There are the two uh, international terminals. Now, maybe for Terminal 3, out. Yeah. I'll just go down a bit. It's kind of a little far away. Okay. Yeah, it's fairly um, quiet today, but anyways, over here, we have a United Boeing 737, and this one is taxiing out for Cleveland. And then we have two United Boeing 747s here. One will be heading to Hong Kong, and one will be heading to Osaka. And then we have uh, little guy here and this one will be going to Detroit and then this Boeing 737 will be heading to Indianapolis and then we have a Boeing 777 that uh, landed not that long ago from uh, we'll say Auckland New Zealand so yeah that's pretty much everything at the United Terminal it's pretty quiet um, let's see all right so now we'll head over to the cargo terminal where we have a lot of Uniteds kind of just chilling out. And there go my papers. Anyway, 
we have a United Boeing 747. And um, this one will be going to Frankfurt soon. Or actually, I think it's backing up. And then we have a United Boeing 777 with service to Beijing, China. And then the United in the two loop livery at the standstill, like always. And then over there, we have a United Boeing 737. And this one is taxiing out for Austin. Okay, and then over here where the cargo is, got a UPS Boeing 747 nonstop to Toronto. DHL Boeing 737, we'll just say this guy's heading up to Seattle. And then another UPS Boeing 747 just came in from White Rock City. And then we have over here a FedEx Express Boeing 777. And uh, this one just came in from Miami. And there's the cargo building. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go fix these papers because I want them flying away. Sorry for the hold up. All right, anyway, now we'll head over to terminal two, but first quickly, I'm just gonna get this guy. Um, this is an express cargo plane and it just landed in from we'll say Michigan and then over here at terminal 2 we'll start off with Alaska today we have uh, in Alaska Boeing 737 and this one we'll be heading out to Columbus another Alaska Boeing 737 and this one's heading out to Washington DC and then we have a third Alaska Boeing 737 in the old delivery. And this one is going to New Orleans. Uh, yeah. Sorry if I sound like a little tired. It's just, it's really hot out today. Um, but anyway, we have a Delta Boeing 757 over here. And this one will be going to Denver. Then we have a Delta A350 going to New York. A Delta Boeing 767 going to New York. And another Delta Boeing 767 that just came in from Atlanta. Yeah, that's everything at that terminal. Um, moving on to the Harveyville terminal. Not really a lot of Southwest action today. Um, I don't know. Would I say this was a quieter day at the airport? Not really. <laughs> just for some terminals, this is like the time of day where a lot of airplanes just have, like departed. Anyways, we have a Southwest in the Canyon Blue livery. This one will be going out to JPE Airport, aka Just Plain Real Toys Airport. Go follow him on Instagram. And then we have a Southwest Boeing 737 in the newer livery. And this one will be making a flight out to St. Louis. And then we have an American Airlines A350 with service to New York. Oh wait, that's not an A350, that's a Boeing 777. My bad, guys. Um, this one will be heading out to, we'll say Melbourne, actually. And then this American Airlines Boeing 777. Oh, Jesus, there's a fly. Get out of here, man. All right, anyways, we have an American Airlines Boeing 777. And this one is in the old livery, and this one will be going to Wuhan. Sorry about that filming, guys. Um, and then we have an American Airlines Boeing 727 in the old livery. This one will be making a really quick flight out to LA. And then American Airlines Boeing 737 in the old livery, which will be going to Philly. And then we have a JetBlue A320 um, with like the square livery and this one will be making a flight out to Boston later. Jeez, I feel like I'm talking kind of fast. But anyway, and we don't have to do an international terminal A because we already did that at the start. So I made pretty good time. We have a few more airplanes over here on these runways to um, go through before we end off the route. But yeah, we have a US Airways Boeing 757. And it is actually taxiing the wrong way. Uh, story behind this is it taxied out to take off, but then it ran out of fuel because of some delays. So now they have to go back to the gates to refuel. And then they will be heading out to New York. All right, and then over here, last but not least, we have a dual takeoff going on of A380s. We have British Airways A380 and an Emirates A380. Um, this one will be heading out to Dubai, and this one will be heading out to London Heathrow. So yeah, that's everything for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Um, and yeah, just subscribe, because we're trying to get to that 100 subscribers mark so we can film the collection video. And yeah, see you guys next time.
Bye.